we're getting into. So let's go over the comp plan. First, you come in. All right, you're at you're at the top of your board. Then you bring in Rob. Okay, Rob is gonna pay. Rob is gonna pay your 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 sponsor whoever bought you in. The next guy who comes in, let's call him Mike. Mike is also gonna pay your sponsor. At this at this juncture, you haven't made no money yet. Okay, now Rob and Mike also need to bring in two people. Rob brings in Joe. Joe's gonna pay you twenty five dollars. Okay, now you've already broken even. Rob also brings in Keith. Keith is going to pay you $25. You just now made $50. Tony, Mike brings in Tony. Tony also pays you $25. And Mike brings in Eric. Eric pays you $25. So at this juncture, you just made $100 off that $125. And all you did was bring in Rob and Mike. Now let's go back for a second. I just want to show you something. Uh, let's say you brought in Rob. And that's all you brung in. Let's forget that Mike's here. Let's say you brung in Rob, and Rob brung in Joe. And let's say Joe brung in Eric. Right away, um, you will make your $25, and and, um, and Rob will make uh, another $25 if, if he bought it somebody right away. You don't have to wait till your two positions get filled. If you bring in one and he brings in one, you get paid right then and there. You don't have, there is no qualifying to get paid. Once you bring in somebody and they bring in somebody, you get paid. You could also, let's say if Rob and Mike are slow, you could also bring in and bring in people yourself who will, who will just follow you. You could fill this whole line by yourself. And uh, this will help Rob and Mike get qualified if you're bringing all these people by yourself. And that's what they call spillover. But just go back to your original the original model, how it's supposed to work, each member brings in two people. So if Rob brings in two and Mike brings in two, this completes your matrix and you just cycled that board for and just made a quick hundred dollars with bringing in two people. Uh, if everybody just brings in two people, it's, it, it, works, it works great. Now, when you cycle, you will um, go to another $25 board, okay? And what will happen is you'll go over there when Rob brings in, when Joe brings his two people and Keith brings in his two people, Rob's board will be complete with six, and Rob will follow you over here again, okay? The same with Eric. When Tony brings in his two people, uh, sorry, same with Mike. When Tony brings in his two people and Eric brings in his two people, that'll complete six people over here, and Mike will follow you back over here to another board, and it, it, the board will just keep repopulating, and that's how they get kind of a residual um, effect going on because as people come in and you cycle, when they cycle, they just keep following you to the next board, to the next board. And the beautiful thing about it, it's only six. It's only, it only takes six people to cycle out a board. Okay. Um, let's talk about upgrades here. There's four different boards. You have a twenty-five dollar board, uh, a fifty cycle, a hundred, and a two hundred. Now I'm gonna call this the ladder of success because the first, the first time you go through. Okay, you're uh, you're basically taking that money to upgrade so you can get into all the boards. Okay, so the f on the first board you're gonna make you're gonna make get twenty five dollars times four payments, so you can make a hundred dollars. You're gonna take twenty five dollars. You're gonna re-enter into the twenty five dollar board. You're gonna take fifty dollars in an upgrade to go to the fifty dollar board, and you're gonna and you also have to pay a ten dollar one time admin fee to go up to the fifty dollar board. Okay, so you're really you're only gonna make about fifteen dollar profit the first time you cycle that twenty five dollar board because you wanna you wanna upgrade to this fifty dollar board here. The same thing here when you get to the fifty dollar cycle, you're gonna make two hundred dollars off that board. You're gonna take fifty dollars and re-enter that board again, and you're gonna take a hundred dollars upgrade to the hundred dollar board. You're gonna take a ten dollars to um, upgrade, so you're only gonna make forty dollars off that board the first time you cycle it. The the same with the hundred. As you can see here, you'll make about ninety dollars off board after you pay your fees to upgrade. And the same, uh, well, the two hundred dollar board is a little bit different because you're already there. Uh, you'll make eight hundred dollars off that board, and you'll cycle. It. When you cycle it, you'll make six hundred pro six hundred dollars profit. Okay, so the total you'll make uh, off that one twenty five dollars the first time you go through is seven hundred and forty five dollars, if my calculations are correct. Okay, now let's talk about. Uh, after you did all your upgrades, the second time you cycle, um, you'll take twenty-five dollars. You'll 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 make a hundred dollars off that board, and you'll take twenty-five dollars, and you'll just recycle to that board again, and you'll make seventy-five dollars. 
the $50 cycle, the second time you cycle it, you make $150 off that board because you're only going to take $50 to re-enter the same $50 boards because remember you don't need to upgrade again because you're, you're already in those boards. The same with the $100. You'll make $300 there. And then the $200 board, you'll make $600 there, okay? And for total profit, you'll make $1,125 every time you cycle all four of those boards. Now the beauty of those things is that all these boards are independent of each other. You can cycle the $25 board three or four times a day. You can cycle the $50 board, $100 board, the $200 board, then back to the $50 to $100 to $25. They all just keep cycling as, as your members follow you through, as your team follows you through. Okay, so um, the reality is you can cycle these boards multiple times a day, month, week, or year. It all depends on your team. So as a leader, when you come in, you just want to, after you get your two, it just makes sense to help everybody else get their two people. Because when they get two people and their board is complete with their six, they're just going to follow you to the next level. And it's going to help you cycle again. So it's, it's, it's all about the team and helping each other. Okay. Um, if you're interested in this program, uh, get back to the person who referred you to this presentation to get started. If you want to join uh, our team, the Ultimate Cycler Kings, uh, then feel free to uh, contact me or, or I'll probably have a link somewhere on this page and uh, we'll get you started today. Uh, hope you have a great day.